the comic book medium has evolved in the last century and the stories that they tell from superheroes and supervillains to exploring gender issues through the last man on earth and the darker sides of human nature with the medium having as many praises as it does critics what do the experts at angry cherry think of the current state of the comic book strip i think that comics has been really influential in people uh, not only in people's lives whereas they can relate to comic books and relate those stories in comic books but movies and everything else all adaptations that come from comics comics are to me anyway they are a form of art where you can create a world or an environment or a fantasy that you can't really always uh, put into a TV show. The, like if you take for example the uh, James Cameron when he went to make Avatar, it would have 15 years for the technology to be good enough. Comic books, you, you can write the story, the world can be as creative as you want to be created. Uh, superhero uh, films aren't the only films that can be adapted out of comics. There's, uh, there's many such as uh, From Hell, which was made by, uh, by Alan Moore. Blue is the Warmest Color was released last year, and it's about uh, uh, a lesbian relationship over 20 years. And so I think, you know, there's many uh, stories to be found uh, rather than superheroes. And I think as time goes on, it's there's more and more that people are, you know, getting into and accepting as, like, really profound, well-made movies. So what does the dairy public have to say about the current state of comic books and graphic novels in today's culture? Well, I can't say I do now at this hour of my life, but I did when I was a kid. I used to get comics when I was very young, like. I got art and storylines. I don't know, why would you like comic books? Uh, mostly for illustrations and stuff. I would read a couple, wouldn't be, wouldn't be very into them. Well. Value in the, in the sense, if I, I still had the value of them from when I was young. So there's value there, isn't there, when I say I would read them again. If they were sitting there with, you know, that I, you know, with the kids and that, I would still read them. Whether you think of comic books as high art that can, can explore human nature, or a commercial product for mindless entertainment, you can't deny that the comic book medium has certainly made its mark on the world's culture.